the artist we out here live at the child abuse center block party i got the off the edge family 10 10 a.m radio is officially in the building it's going down It's your boy LG, and I'm here with Chuck at the Child Abuse Center block party, and he's about to just tell us a couple things what's going on. Hey, how you doing today? It's a uh, second annual uh, community block party for the Baltimore Child Abuse Center. April is Child Abuse Awareness Month, so uh, we just wanted to pull the community together, learn ways to keep your children safe. Uh, a lot of vendors out today selling wear, music, you know, it's just a good time for the community partners to come together. Uh, a lot of nonprofits out here also, you know, trying to get out information in the community that, uh, you know, if they need help and stuff like that, there are places they can find help to, you know, to, to come and uh, search for it. This has been a wonderful day for the Baltimore Child Abuse Center. So this is their second annual block party for the community. The community came out strong. They had a lot of entertainment. And the Afro-American Newspapers was very proud to be a sponsor and supporting of this agency. My name is Brian Waters. I'm representing Best Buy uh, Store 1436 in Owens Mills, Maryland. We're here at the uh, Charles Street Block Party. We basically like to uh, reach out to the community in any way we can. We're not just about uh, selling and um, being a business, we actually reach out to the community, whether it's Baltimore City, Baltimore County, uh, Carroll County, all the neighboring counties. What's going on, y'all? I'm standing here with A Plus Dropout, the newest, hottest, hottest music sensation that's hitting the block. And we're out here at the Child Abuse Center Block Party, and they just did a wonderful, wonderful set. You guys, tell us a little bit about what you guys got going on. Oh, well, we're a band. We formed about five months ago, mm -hmm. and, you know, it's just for fun. We primarily do uh, mixes of rock and just punk rock and everything around that genre. We've been doing gigs for a little while, and we've done things like the Cherry Blossom Festival. We've uh, played in Baltimore uh, once or twice, uh, and we've done a lot. What else do you guys got coming up? You guys got any more shows coming up? Quite a few. We're playing the Launch um, Music Festival up in Pennsylvania this next Saturday coming up. Okay, cool. And uh, where can people hear more of your music from online? Aplusdropouts.com and on Facebook. You can search us as the A Plus Dropouts. What up, what up, what up? This is E Nice down here at the Child Abuse Festival. We're keeping it real off the edge. We got an interview with my friend Edge right here. What brings you out here tonight? E, you know, keeping it real, keeping it real TV. Oh, all right, all right. That's what's up. It's your first time here? You already know what it is. I'm out here with my Off the Edge fam, 1010 10 AM radio. All right, Edge. Thanks for the interview, man. What's up, y'all? We in the building, Off the Edge radio, every Saturday, 11 AM to noon. You already know what it is. What up, what up, what up? what up? T.T., what's up with some of these uh, art events that's going on and stuff like man, that? Man, it's a lot. You know, it's a lot going on. You know, Baltimore is not just a music city, but it's an art city. Mm -hmm. And I've had the special, special privilege of being a part of a lot of these art shows. Recently, I just had an art show at the 788 gallery i mean okay. it was awesome it was a tattoo yeah. party i mean they even had exotic dancers in there oh, wow. getting tatted like it was what? at least 200 people yeah. from about 6 p.m to like midnight it was oh, crazy. Wow. crazy and then they're gonna keep i got an actual listening party coming up on april 22nd at that same venue it's gonna be oh, yeah? live free fun but it's gonna be fun. definitely definitely live yeah what's going on it's your girl tt the artist we here live in the building keeping it real tv Exclusive behind the scenes at the 788 Gallery going on in Picktown, Baltimore, holding it down. We got live art, live tattoo artists, live music, DJs spinning on the ones and twos. It don't get no better than that. Keeping it real. Stay tuned. Go big girl, go big girl, yeah. go big girl, go big girl, what? Go big girl, go big girl, huh? go big girl, go big yep. girl, yeah, yeah. Go big girl, she rock it, rock, rock, big girl, she rock it, rock, rock, big girl, she rock it. Hey, we're keeping it real at Gallery 788, and I am Art Fish, and this is my stuff. I am here too, 
788. Look my paintings. Some of them got sold. And you should come check it out because this is the place to be. Baltimore, be more, holding it down. What's going on? My name is Brandon Hill. I'm originally from Baltimore, Maryland. My studio's in DC right now. This is an example of what I do. I'm all about trying to take something that's uh, real faded and real kind of jacked up and polishing it. And uh, that's an example of what I got. What's up? This is your girl, Janine Nicole, stylist innovator. Um, hit me up on my blog spot, www.jeneenicole.com. I'm at 788 Gallery in Baltimore, chilling with my girl TT, the phenomenal artist. Um, seen her come a long way, and if you haven't, you need to check her out at ttheartist.blogspot.com. Yo, she rock it, rock, rock. She rock it. Yo, she rock it, rock, rock. She rock it. What it do is your boy Hollywood off the edge radio 10 to 10 a.m. We keeping it real. Suggest you do the same. What it do is Skola Man off the edge radio. We keeping it real. Chip. Keeping it real TV off the edge radio. Your boy AMG hosting it, man. You already know what it is, man. What up, what up, what up? It's your boy E Nice off the edge. We keeping it real off the edge. <laughs>